Arlington, Texas, Aaron Rodgers did it again. He burned the Dallas Cowboys again with some last-minute magic at AT&T Stadium, capping a 75-yard drive with a 12-yard touchdown pass to Devant Adams that lifted the Green Bay Packers to a 35-31 comeback victory. The game-winning throw a patented back shoulder pass that beat rookie corner Jordan Lewis in the left corner of the end zone, followed an 18-yard, back-breaking scramble by Rodgers. Once again, Rodgers escaped to his left on the big run, the same side of the field he floated to in the NFC Divisional Playoff game here in January to complete a 35-yard pass to Jared Cook on third and 20 in the final seconds that set up the game-winning field goal. This time, the Packers, 4-1, needed a huge comeback, wiping out a 15-point, first-half deficit to Dow's Dallas, 2-3. Suddenly, big leads are a big problem in Big D. For the second week in a row, the Cowboys squandered a good start on their home turf and paid for it with a glaring loss. A week ago, the Los Angeles Rams notched a signature comeback. Now Rodgers who completed 19 of 29 passes for 221 yards with three TDs, leaves another memorable marker. The Packers rallied from a 21-6 deficit late in the second quarter by scoring 16 unanswered points to take a one-point lead early in the fourth with their longest drive of the season, a 14-play, 88-yard march capped by Rodgers' 10-yard toss to Jordy Nelson. And Mason Crosby's pat was hardly a given. The kicker who won last season's playoff contest with a 51-yard field goal as time expired, missed his first two conversion kicks Sunday. But the Cowboys, outscored 19-6 by the Rams in Week 4 on their way to squandering a 24-13 halftime lead, managed to one-up Crosby and the Packers when it came to mishaps. Green Bay's long scoring drive was aided by two Dallas penalties, a late hit call on Benson Maia early in the drive then a defensive holding flag on Lewis. The Packers also converted a fourth-and-one play near midfield when rookie Aaron Jones, 19 carries, 125 yards, subbing for injured running back Ty Montgomery, rumbled 10 yards on a toss play. The march set the stage for a furious finish. After the Cowboys regained the lead on a 43-yard field goal from Dan Bailey, the Packers stung Doc Prescott for a pick-six. Damarius Randall returned the interception 21 yards for the score, that gave them the lead back. Then Dallas fashioned a long drive of its own, 17 plays, 79 yards, consuming 8 minutes, 43 seconds, capped by Prescott's 11-yard TD run. That gave Dallas a 34-31 lead with 1.13 on clock, plenty of time for Rodgers to make a bit more magic at the Cowboys' expense.